Hi everyone! So today I will be showing you guys how to get big sexy curls like the Victoria's Secret models. Of course you may not be able to get the body but you definitely have their hair. So um, just as you guys can tell my hair is not wet. Uh, that's the worst time to work with your hair is when it's wet because that's when it's most fragile. So step one. I like to use some type of protective cream for my hair. Uh, just because I'll be using so many uh, heated instruments, I'd like to have a protective coat. And here, as you can see, I'm using Kerastase uh, Nutrisculpt. It's a little expensive, but I purchased mine on eBay for about $25, so it's a really good deal. So first things first, you're going to do a couple of pumps. I would say probably I start with four and just see how much you need. And just kind of rub it around your hands, your palms, and then just go through your hair. Okay, now that your hair has that protective layer, you're going to take your curl, oh, curling iron, and what I like to usually start with are my bangs. So I found my bangs, and I'm going to take my curling iron. It is a one and a half inch barrel from Hot Tools, which I believe are the best. And then with your bangs, I think you should always roll back and not roll forward. So, see here, I'm going to grab it right in the center and then wrap it around. I believe that when you do it at the tip, you don't get as much of a curl. So I'm going to pull back a little and just roll back. And so you're going to keep this, uh, you're going to count till five, and then you're going to unroll. Kind of make sure you, the rest of your hair is pulled back. Ooh, did you see that smoke come out? That's not always good. But as you can tell, my hair is a little, little curled, as weird as it looks. And now, I am going to take my hair roller that I got from Sally's Beauty Supply. I believe this is a one and a half inch curling iron. Just roll it back. Uh, the, the curl that was already formed, you're just going to roll it into the uh, this plastic curler. And then you're going to clip. I like to use a clip on curls just because they're a lot easier to uh, maneuver. And they don't pull in your hair. What you want to do is go around with your whole hair, your whole head of hair, and do this all over. And so I will be doing that, and then when I come back, I have my whole head full of rollers. And I'll show you guys the end result. Hi, as you can see, my whole head is full of rollers. Um, I tried to be as clean as possible, but obviously, I wasn't. Um, so it's been about 20 minutes. Um, I don't recommend you taking your rollers off this soon. Usually when I work with rollers, I try to leave them in for at least an hour just to get uh, the best effect. But I'm just going to take it out for you guys just so you guys can see. Try to take these out quickly as possible. Now because I didn't um, leave them in for that long, I would probably end up using some type of hairspray, which are, isn't my favorite, just because it makes my hair sticky and more vulnerable in terms of breakage, but uh, beauty hurts, I guess. Okay, so I know it looks crazy right now, but you're just going to shake it out and kind of run your hair through it. Okay, and that is Sexy Victoria's Secret Hair 101. I hope you guys like this tutorial, and I hope it works out for you too. Thanks for watching.